a memorable moment of mine, and like as far as like like fanning out over a DJ to be like a complete fan, that that would have to be D Styles because I always thought D Styles was like so funky and intricate, like on the scratch patterns. But I never knew what he looked like. Everybody knew who uh, Qbert looked like. Everybody knew who Shortcut looked like. Everybody knew who uh, you know J Rock or Shortcut or wh whoever was Red Man. Everybody knew what they looked like, but just I just never knew who D Styles looked like. So. I uh, lost in like a three-way tie with uh, a, a, a friend of my Precision, my, one of my crewmates, Precision, and um, at the time was this young kid from uh, Hawaii who I still keep in contact with. His name is DJ Solution at the time. He was like 14, 15 on the come up, and he was like the young prodigal DJ, you know, of that time, like in 2000, 2001. I was pissed. I kicked the chair. I'm like, I lost, rah, 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 kicking shit over. And um, I went, go to the bar, I'm drinking. I'm like, fuck it, give me Henny, whatever. Blah, blah, blah. You know, and I'm backstage chilling and I'm packing all my stuff up, making sure I'm not, you know. And the guy was like, yo, man, you were really clean. Like, your set was clean. Like, like your cuts are clean. Like, yo, how do you get so clean? I was like, I don't know. I'll just be practicing and stuff like that. And, you know, I just took it as that was just somebody there. And then all the other DJs backstage were like, yo, that was these styles. And I was like, where hurt? And I ran back out. I was like, yo, like, you're like one of the best ever. And, you know, at that time, it was like portable camera era. You just take the, you buy the little camera, I took pictures and stuff. And um, and like I said, maybe like a year or two later, um, I bumped into him again uh, of, of the strength of my man Boz Vaughn and House Shoes. And they got me to do a set at the um, the party that they do at the airline of the, the Low End Theory. And that was a really dope party because I like the Low End Theory because you could trap it out. You can, you know what I'm saying? Like you could just be as 808-ish as you want to be, you know?